Ellie Solly of Dawes was alive when World War I began and remembers when World War II ended. She's among a growing number of seniors in this country living to see their 100th birthday. That is amazing. Just this week, LC and Local 15's Darren Singleton went for a little drive, but Darren was not the one behind the wheel. <laughs> like she does every year, Elsie Solly raised a garden this year. Cucumbers and tomatoes and okra and pepper, the whole works. And Elsie doesn't mind sharing those veggies with her son and his children and his children's children and his children's children's children. When you've lived as long as Elsie, you know that family is everything. How does that feel to be 100 years old? No, I don't see why it feels much different <laughs> than 99. <laughs> before. <laughs> Elsie was born less than a mile from her house in the Dees community, learned reading and writing and arithmetic at a little country school oh, even closer. Here. Her husband, Philip, died of tuberculosis after only 12 years of marriage, and she never married again. Well, what I, what I would have wouldn't have me. So. <laughs> what she did do was throw herself into family and business. She became a local sales representative for Avon products, and she was good at it, winning award after award. And the quality that made her a good salesperson is the same quality she credits for keeping her lively today. If you trust in the Lord and and eat, eat right and take exercise and have a good attitude, you live longer. Mm -hmm. Elsie remembers the days before TVs, telephones, and air conditioning. But when those newfangled automobiles first lumbered down the road in front of her house, she knew that was one fad she wasn't about to do without. She learned to drive at age 20. And just last week, at the age of 99, Elsie went to get her driver's license renewed again. Sure. I was about to... Faint. <laughs> Afraid I wouldn't get them, but I did. And when I asked Elsie to take me to one of her favorite places in the world, she fired up the Chevy Impala, and off we went. And yes, she's a good driver, and if you're in a hurry, she's the one you want behind the wheel. Let's just say we arrived much sooner than I expected. And this is our destination, the Union Baptist Church. It's where Elsie celebrated her 100th birthday Saturday with family and friends. Most of my friends are church members and that's where most of my social life is, is through the church. Elsie Solly of Dees has seen more of life than most of us ever will, and she wouldn't think of wasting a minute of it, not in a hundred years. What makes you smile these days? Talking to you. <laughs> Here's Darwin, Local 15 News. You know, just about everybody that talks to Darwin smiles. There's no doubt about it. Elsie has some catching up to do. You know, we introduced you to Eunice Mitchell of Pritchard earlier this week. She celebrated her 104th birthday. And in Thomasville, Pearly Ando turned 108. And it looks like we have some.